Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. We were just about to take the tram uh, to the lab, actually, but we don't want to do that. Not yet. Because. Because. Uh, I found out what that key's for. It's for the other, um, it's for the other warehouse, actually. The one that we just tried to get into earlier. I didn't think there was much in there, but yeah, there is, apparently. Apparently there is some Magnum, uh, a Magnum magazine. And, uh, some shotgun shells. Oh, I like the way Ada doesn't even come with us. Well, fuck you then, Ada. You can stay there by yourself and, you know, sulk in the corner. We go off and do, you know, important things. Like, go find a Magnum magazine. Oh, yeah, we still got the spitters. Right, let's go. I actually think... Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I was going to say, I actually think... Um... There might be zombies here now. Now we've emptied this water. Or, you know, prob uh, probably cut apart by some sort of edged tool. Yeah, I don't think he was cut apart by an edged tool. Go away, guys. Yeah, I thought there were zombies here now. Oh, hey, guys. Sit down. Let's have a little uh, look. I very rarely come back here, to be honest. The Umbrella Inc. logo is printed on the mask. Yeah, I wonder if these guys actually have anything. We can use our ammo here quite liberally. It don't matter. We're just about to retire the handgun anyway, to be honest. Come yeah, man. Really? Why are you... Why are you not actually getting hit? Alright, you're not dead. You are dead now. That's weird. It's too dark to see inside. I don't want to see inside. Unless you mean it's too dark to see inside his, like, guts. Which is possible, I suppose. Right, you're gone. Now, let's go back to the warehouse and find our secret supplies. Um, yeah, so it was this one. How interesting. Kind of weird that there's two save rooms, like, this close, when you think about it. But we shall uh, switch out. I think we're basically done with the handgun now. Gonna switch up to our shotty. Shotty's more fun anyway, let's be honest. Uh, right. Yeah, it kind of makes sense now, because of course, when Claire comes here, she can use her lockpick to open this up. Which is not in the realm of possibility. For, actually. For Leon. I, can't, I always forget. We're gonna have that. And we might as well take a submachine gun, to be honest. We've got some uh, ammo. We can actually get this uh, reloaded as well. Because, um, of course, we've already uh, set that in motion in uh, Claire's game. Now, if I was. There we go. Smoky. Now let's go down. Because I was always confused. I was like, why is there no zombie uh, down here for Cla uh, for Leon? I was like, oh, well, you know, obviously. Um, it's because Claire's already been through here. But of course, that's not accurate at all. Because we were in the wrong warehouse. 
Come on, buddy. How greedy are you? There we go. He's dead. So we've got some shells there. Lovely. Not bad. That's definitely um, worth coming back for, I think. Well, I, yeah. I say it's worth coming back for. I mean, it really isn't because we didn't need that ammo, to be fair. But, eh. Just means we have options when we get to the lab. We can basically use whatever we want. Because we've got more ammo than you can shake a stick at, yo. That leads back. Oh, right. Yeah, that... Hang on, did I even go into that other warehouse then as Claire? I don't think I did, did I? Hmm. Annoying. Not that it matters at all, to be fair. But still, I don't like leaving ammo and weapons behind, even if we do have more ammo and weapons than we will ever use. Like, the only way we're going to use this ammo is if we decide to start shooting it into the wall. Um, right. Let's go. So the spiders actually disappear. The web spinners disappear in here. Um... For reasons... Do they get killed by the zombies? That's weird. I mean, I doubt it. Uh-oh. Run! And I really, really don't get why they um, took the spiders out of the remake. That's so weird, because spiders are such an uh, iconic enemy uh, in the Resident Evil series. You know? Like, especially 1 and 2. thinking about it. Well, mainly one and two, really. Can't really think of spiders in the later games. Come on, Ada. Let's get our asses out of here. Now, the lab is quite different on the B game. Oh, man. Ooh. Hello. Naughty. It's a bit touchy-feely for my liking. Every now and again, Ada will fire a shot or two. She's not really great. Her AI is awful, to be honest. I don't know if you have to shoot him here, to be honest. Yeah, I guess you do. Yeah, sometimes she will shoot. Uh, I guess sometimes she just straight up doesn't. She's a bit annoying. It makes no difference. We are here at last. About to enter the secret underground lab. Alright, uh, come on, Ada. Let's go. No point waiting around here forever. Now, of course, we don't want to forget this little puppy hidden away, do we? Oh, yes. We're going to be wanting that bad boy. Come on, Ada. Let's roll. I love the ambient music here. You know, actually, this kind of music here reminds me of Final Fantasy VII. Not this uh, electronic kind of rifty bit, but the bit beforehand. Hey! Well done, Ada. You did it. You did something useful. How do you feel? She doesn't, like, attack these enemies. There we go. We can kind of trigger her into shooting them, though. Come yeah, man. There we go. If you attack a zombie, she will sometimes attack. Unless she's out of ammo now. No, I guess it's out of her range. Okay, I don't know. I don't know, like, how she decides what to shoot and what not to shoot. It's kind of strange. Right, buddy. Oi, cough up the goods. Come on. 
There we go. Reach deep into his back pocket if uh, <clears throat> if you get what I mean. I assume it's in his back pocket. Nope, we're clear. No zombies. Which is good. Now, I think... I mean, our SMG is just about Winchester. Uh, we got more Zeds. Of course we got more Zeds. Why won't we? Hey guys! Come on, Ada. Light them up. No point using my ammo. I can get Ada to use hers. There we go. Really, buddy? There we are. How much we got left? 18%. Dude. That sucks. Oh, he's a puker. I don't see many pukers in this game. There we go, he's down. Try and go down. Right, there might be one around this corner. Nope, we're good. Uh, we got two item spaces. Which is good, because we have two herbs here. We will take the blue, because we can still get poisoned in the game. Because we use the BOW gas uh, in our A scenario, that means the plants will be poisonous, because they mutate. I can't remember the advantage of using the BOW gas, actually. I think it makes the enemy... The enemy's weaker. Well, I'm not 100% sure on that. But, whatever. We finally we arrived. Did. There must be something hidden here. There must be. That's the only possible explanation. Why do you think there's something hidden here, Ada? It's kind of strange. It's a strange assumption. Right, let's jiggle our junk around. Um, we're going to retire that. I mean, it's basically empty. We're going to get our shotgun. Because we've got just seriously more shells than we're going to use. Um, actually, we could have one last hurrah for the SMG. We don't need that for now. Um, we don't need herbs. I say we don't need herbs. That's going to be like a famous last word thing, isn't it? We'll be out and then horribly murdered by a goit that just comes out of nowhere. Uh, yeah, we are just going to do that. We will use that up because why not? There is something coming up that would be beneficial. I love this music. Why do we have the knife? Leon, why do you have the knife? You don't need the knife, buddy. The knife is like... Well, I would say obsolete, but that's an understatement. Now, the shotgun does look cool. Now, it's fully upgraded, but it's just useless. I mean, look how many shotgun shells we got. Seriously. And again, <laughs> another Magnum magazine. Because, why not, I guess. Alright. A Magnum might not be a terrible... Yeah, we got 48 rounds of Magnum now. Do you think that's enough? I think that's enough. Uh, let's go. Right, you stay here, Ada. We will go and find the thing for the thing. Uh, there's actually some handgun bullets, like, hidden up... Ooh. Yeah, there is some handgun bullets hidden here, but, I mean, yeah, they're there. But we don't need them. We don't want them. The handgun is officially, as of this point, retired. She is obsolete. Which is a shame, because the, uh, the handgun, like the Matilda, is a lot of fun to use. Righty tighty. Hey, you notice the camera there. I don't think there's anything that useful here. We've got that. I did think there was shotgun shells here, but there isn't. Oh no! Would you look at that? Guess who's back? Back again. X is back. 
tell a friend. Hey, buddy. You're going to smash my camera now, aren't you? Oh, you go it. Those things are expensive. Why did you attack the camera? Asking for a friend. Okay. Let's just... There we go. Let's see how much it takes to bring him down. Ouch! Okay, not that much, actually. Oh, lovely. You, sir, are a gentleman. Just what I wanted. Some more shotgun shells. Thank you very much. We will take the sea panel key, because sure. Well, our SMG is now exhausted, so we can get out of here. And we're going to get some more hang uh, magnum rounds in a minute anyway. But you can see, like, the comical, like, blowback of the shotgun. It's like, uh, It's very hard to take it seriously. I mean, the main reason it's actually even worth it, to be honest, is the fact that, um... It holds an extra two cartridges. Although, you can just pause the game in your inventory and reload the weapons anyway, so... It's not like, it's not even a huge big deal, to be honest. A machine, yes, there's there's a hole. Well, let's use the hole. Use the hole for the key. Come on, let's go. Yeah, we're gonna go, but we're gonna take some stuff with us. And we're gonna drop back the SMG, which is now totally exhausted. <laughs> Well, Mr. Mac 10, we've enjoyed you. I think it's a Mac 11 actually in this game, I'm not really sure. Uh, just in case. Just in case. Don't want to get caught with our pants down now. Come on, Ada. Let's get the fuck out of here. Come on, you. Time's a wasting. Um, 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 um. Oh, do we need to push the button? We may need to push the button. Yes, we need to push the button. I love that sound. I don't know why. It's just alerted like every beastie to our position right now. Okay, free lunch here, fuckers. Come take a nice bite out of Leon's ass. I'm sure there's plenty of people that would love to do that. Myself not included. Oh shit. Why is it with Leon? And why is her medallion, like, floating above her chest? Let's not ask these questions. Alright, give me them. Um, I don't think there's anything in here. No. Right, let's go say hello to Mr. Tough Guy outside. He's a bit of a dick, actually. Case of an emergency, blah, 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 blah. Yes, we know. Case of an emergency, we need to go sort out the problem. No freeloaders! Alright. Let's go see if he's got a ticket, shall we? Come on, William. Alright, buddy. Do you have a ticket to ride? Oh, you're ugly. Dude. I've heard there's a cream for that. Ugh. Alright, buddy. You don't even worry about it, my friend. I've got the cure for what ails you. Oh, 
Uh oh. We're gonna run. Because when he does that, he likes to um, be a bit of a goit. And jump. Ouch, 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 ouch. Yeah, he likes to do that. Uh, oh, okay. It's quite often. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Yeah, we're kind of pinned in the floor here, which is not actually that fantastic. We're on danger. Boy, am I glad I brought... Ouch, ouch. Right, he's done. Yeah, that was bad on my part. Like, really bad on my part. Right, you can fuck off now, pal. Good thing we've been hoarding all of this uh, magnum ammo. Very good thing we've been hoarding all this magnum ammo. Yeah, that was not good to get pinned in the corner there. Warning, the motor has been stopped due to problems with overheating. Really? Hi right there, Ada. Welcome back. <laughs> he always says that, doesn't he? Hey, Can you hear me? Easy. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. Take it easy. I'll only slow you down. To yes, you will. Trees. Go. Save yourself. Is it just me, or does everybody always ignore what I uh. say? <laughs> I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time, but I really enjoy being with what? you. What? This doesn't make any I... doesn't make any sense. I know. I'm not capable of caring about anyone. I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. I love how this just comes out of nowhere. Just like... Uh, I, it... It happens so fast. Well, well, as Snake says, uh, love does seem to... Or at least Metal Gear. Love does seem to bloom on the battlefield. Um, right, let's take that. And she's really enjoyed being with us. Well, to be fair, I've enjoyed being with her as well. Slaying zombies, you know. Let's go. No freeloaders allowed. Your ticket is revoked, sir. Fuck off. Right, now. Ooh. Yep, well, I don't think that was meant to happen, Leon. And as soon as we get off, the bloody train cools down and, well, disappears. I also like the way he says, don't worry, we're in Umbrella's secret lab. Don't worry. Don't worry. That's like the last place you want to be. Surely. Ah, uh, what do I know? Nobody thinks sense around here. Never mind. Anyway, this is actually an item room. Oh, I hate this bit. I'll tell you why I hate this bit. Oh, there's a herb there. Very nice. Don't mind if I drew. Considering we've just used one. Um, We can actually... We can put that back for now. Yeah, we don't need this. Do you know, actually, there is a... Quite a lack of um, red herbs in this game, isn't there? Alright, this puzzle is a pain in the ass because if you don't get it... Well, I say puzzle loosely. This bit is a pain in the ass because if you don't get it spot on, you end up having to fiddle around with it for ages. Kind of got to get it about there. A little bit something like that. Nah, I think we need to move it a little bit further over yet, Leon. I hate these box puzzles in these old RE games. I really do. There we go. Lovely. Cool. Alright, let's go down. Let's go deeper underground. Just what we wanted to do. Alright, let's... 
give this a little shove out of here. Like that. And I think... If we judge this just about right, we can... Yes! Oh, I thought we didn't... I thought I didn't leave enough clearance there. I was like, no! Curses! Leon, you fool! But no, it's fine. Everything's good. It's all gravy, baby. It's all gravy. Uh, mm, yes, 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 that's fine. Everything looks fine. I want to know what's in this box. Like, seriously. Don't think about cracking it open, Leon. Could be anything in here. Could be, could be full of money. Could be full of ammo. Well, to be honest, we've got enough ammo on us anyway. We're never going to use all this ammo. And that's a crime. To be honest, like, it's a criminal offence not to be able to use all this ordnance because we've got so much of it. We've got ammo coming out of our ass. Not literally, that would be weird. I mean, Mr. X has ammo coming out of his ass. I wonder if every time Leon dies, he, like, drops ammo. Hello, my zombie friend that's not actually a zombie. Investigative report on P Ypsilon gas. Ah, now we obviously didn't get this file in the first one. In the first run. Uh, this report demands immediate attention. The P Ypsilon gas has been proven capable of incapacitating all known BOWs, bioorganic weapons. As such, it has been des uh, designated for emergency use in the event of a BOW escape. Reports based upon data collected during the prior accidents uh, indicate the potential for negative side effects. The P Epsilon gas has been proven to weaken BOW's cellular functions. However, prolonged or repeated exposure will result in the creation of adaptive antibodies to the agent. Furthermore, some species have been observed to absorb the P Epsilon, P -epsilon gas as a source of nutrition and use the toxins extracted against anything perceived as a threat. Use of the P Epsilon gas should be severely limited to extreme cases only. We strongly request that the request the authority to reevaluate the P Epsilon gas deployment system. We would like the, uh, this reevaluation to take place immediately. Yeah, so basically if you use the gas in the first Scenario like we did. It's now mutated the uh, the zombies, or not the zombies. The uh, we've got almost a hundred shotgun shells. Um, yeah, it's now mutated the bloody uh, plants, and they're now poisonous, which is not great. I mean, you know, just to be fair, it's really not that fantastic. We've got liquors. We've got a liquor problem. Let's put some more cartridges in our shotgun. We're ready. Now, unfortunately, this thing now has a much tighter uh, spread. So you can't use it to literally clear rooms out anymore. But, still kind of effective. As you can see, it doesn't really do a lot more damage. Uh, let's go flip the switch. Yeah, we're going to turn the elevator on. All systems full power. Alright. Now, ooh, what do we have here? A, the iron smelting pool. Employees only. Why do they have an iron smelting pool? I think somebody's been watching too much Terminator 2, or at least back in the oldie days. Way too much Terminator 2 reference. Alright, let's get out of here. Now, I can't remember what was up here. I guess we're about to find out. Oh, yeah, I know. We can't... Yeah, we can't go there yet. We can't do that yet. Because that door is locked. Right. So, let's get out of here. 
Oh my, we're on half an hour already. Holy shit. Time really does fly when you're having fun, guys. So, uh, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you very much for watching. When we return, we're going to get out of here and uh, make our way back into the lab as we know it. However, it is slightly different with Leon. This is what I like about the B scenario in the original game. It's different. It's actually sufficiently different um the b scenario or second run in the remake was massively massively underwhelming it was so disappointing now the remake was still exceptional it was brilliant but yeah they played way too safe in in the uh, second run game it, to the point where in all honesty is what was the point in the second run you know, it was just like, apart from the way the game starts and a few item um, placements, it was the same as the first run. Um, yeah, it's just, I think what they should have done in all fairness in the remake was just make the main um, first run longer. But I guess having the second run and changing it up a little bit, a tiny amount, um, a keeps it similar to the to the original and uh, I guess it's an easier way to pad the game out because you then got technically two scenarios to play through even though they're like well four scenarios actually considering they're basically identical yeah really strange and I'm not alone in thinking that either um, as I said the remake superb absolutely fucking fantastic but yeah, it, not without his issues. Anyway, thank you very much, guys. And as always, till next time.